Hello, welcome to the Sherpaat journey. This is Devendra Veligenla. In this lesson, you will learn how to create site collections in Sherpaat 2013. We will learn few concepts like Coda templates, what is the storage limit concept, and how we are going to define the managed paths, what is explicit inclusion, what is wildcard inclusion. Okay, so let's open the virtual machine and from here open the central administration so this is our uh, central administration click on application management click on create site collection the first option is in which web application you are going to create the site collection that is we have selected already here by default and couple of things you wanted to know is the storage limit quota templates so here we have already one quota template which is of sales which has been set for 500 MB so all the data which can be stored can be limited to 500 MB so this set collection can have only 500 MB if I set this particular quota template if you want to manage that quota template click on manage quota templates you can change the limits according to your requirement and even you can change the sandbox solution with code limits as well okay and the next thing we need to check is what is managed paths let's have a look here you can have explicit inclusion and wildcard inclusion explicit inclusion if you type something let's say topics and make it as explicit inclusion you can create one site collection using this particular topics and whereas white cloud ex inclusion is you type something like uh, sales and click on add path what you can do is you can create various site collections using sales I'll show you how now if I go to create site collection option if I see here under the URL I have all these options sales sites topics so with the topics I can create only one site collection but with the sales and sites I can create many you see here with the topics I'm not getting any other option but with the sales I'm getting option to enter the site collection name this will be a prefix okay so let's go ahead and create a site collection enter the title and description as and I am entering the same thing as the description also I will select sites marketing sites is the managed path here which is of wildcard inclusion and the, under the template selections earlier you don't have any option but now we have 2013 and 2010 as well so 2010 is for backward compatibility uh, we'll see how that can be managed if you go to see program files common files like of shared web server extensions you have both 14 high folder and 15 high folder so that is how the older version like SharePoint 2010 version sites are getting supported okay. in this case I have chosen team site I'll enter primary site collection administrator secondary site collection administrator is not mandatory click ok to create the site collection you can see here it is showing working on it now you can observe the top level site collection has been created successfully click on that to open the top level site collection You can see the URL here, the speech journey sites marketing. Now it's showing working on it. You can see here the site collection with marketing has been created successfully. So thank you for your time. We'll see you in the next lesson.